Three years of extreme drought have shaken the American farm industry to the point many farmers simply can't continue. One Limestone County, Alabama farmer facing that bleak future was Noby Daly. For the past five years, Daly's been farming 1,200 acres in North Alabama. But after three years of shrinking harvests, rising costs, and growing loan balances, Daly was facing the real possibility that 2007 was going to be his last year of farming. You know, I was, I was probably going to have to quit this year, um, you know, after this year. And, and it would have had a big dad hanging over my head, too. The, the conditions I was in, you were either going to have to make it or, or, or break it. But Daly's brother-in-law told him about something he could apply and afford that might help. Daly says he decided to try it because, well, there wasn't much left to lose. It was uh, offered to me as a, you know, you, I had nothing to lose by trying, you know. Daly had applied Accelagro, and this all-natural plant stimulant transformed him from another suffering Alabama farmer to the best performing farmer in Limestone County, Alabama. Unlike other farmers, Daly's crops from soybeans to cotton were graded first quality in the toughest growing conditions imaginable. I have a top crop of cotton this year and that's, uh, there's no top crop of cotton nowhere around. It's, uh, the, the, uh, it's the only cotton on, in this county that, that's gonna make anything. The fields that I, where I, you know, follow directions and done it right, I, I, I had excellent results out of those, out of those crops. I, I feel a lot better about myself now. You know, I feel like, you know, maybe things will be, you know, turning around now and be back in the, in the good side instead of the up down side, upside down side and, uh, you know, farming is what I do, you know, it's, uh, so, I, you know, you, um, just try to get good at what you do, you know, that's what, that's what I, so, uh, and cellar grow is, uh, most definitely in my, in my plan, you know, in my plans, you know, I mean, that's what I'll be using, I'm a, I'm a believer in cellar grow. For this Alabama farmer, the toughest time he's ever suffered through appears to be ending. That's despite the fact drought projections don't offer much encouragement for 2008. For Noby Daly, Accelagro has meant more than a way to help improve his crops. Accelagro has enabled this young farmer to continue to do what he loves. And, and this year I was able to, to, to pull out and with, uh, with uh, payout yields and, and, uh, and that's, what, that's what this business is all about. You know, just trying to stay ahead of the game. I'm Dennis Knight with Cellagro Technologies. Noby Daly's success story is one of many we've had throughout the Southeast this year. In a time of severe drought that has overtaken the Southeast and other parts of the country, it's good to know that a farmer has an opportunity to make a living farming. One thing that we at Cellagro are trying to do is help the American farmer, no matter how large or how small. Noby, who farms 1,200 acres or some of the other farms we are on that farms many thousands of acres, have been able to see a difference that a Cellagro makes throughout this time of stress when little water is available. A cellar grow does make the difference. So we're happy to help Noby Daly and all the other farmers survive in a time when if they didn't have our product, they probably would go under. And we will continue to work uh, throughout the years to continue to help the farmers grow and prosper uh, in a time when it's hard to make a living farming in America.